Boy, am I excited. I'm here at the Baker County Courthouse in McClenny, Florida. Back years ago in the 1940s, my grandfather served on the Baker County Commission. In fact, he was on the county commission when this courthouse was built. That's why his name is up on the, uh, on the cornerstone of the courthouse. And what's even more exciting was in the 1980s, in 1984, I was elected to the Baker County Commission and served in this very courthouse for four years. I tell people I got elected in 1984 and promptly unelected in 1988 because the people couldn't stand any more of that. But, but the reason I'm here today is because behind this plaque there was a time capsule. And this time capsule was placed there when the courthouse was dedicated back in, in 1944. And so it's kind of exciting to see something like that opened up. And when they pulled it out, there were newspapers from that time that showed stories about what was happening in, in, in this county back in that time. There were minutes from county commission meetings where you could see what was going on. So it was kind of interesting. And you know, it got me to thinking, our life, in a way, it's like a time capsule. I mean, the things that you and I do every day is being stored away. And for those who know Jesus Christ as their Lord and Savior, one day we're going to stand before God and our time capsule will be opened up and all that we've done, the good and the bad, will be brought out of that time capsule. And the Bible says that it will be thrown through a fire and it will be tested by the fire. And some of the things that you and I think we've done that were so great will be destroyed by the fire. But there'll be some things that will come out on the other side. And we're going to receive a reward for those things because those are the things that we've done in Jesus' name with the right heart and the right spirit. You know what? I hope you know Jesus Christ as your Lord and Savior because you know what? The lost people will stand before God one day too. And their time capsule will be opened up and they will also be judged. I tell you what, I'd rather be standing before God with that fire that's just going to test my works as a Christian than to be standing before God facing an eternal fire. So what's in your time capsule? What's been stored away in your time capsule to be revealed one day before God? I'm telling you, when you think about it, it can be a little scary, but at the same time, if you know Jesus, it can be a boy am I excited.